Every case has a different value. Every case is unique. Every case has different facts. You could have a disputed liability situation where the insurance company is saying our insured or defendant driver is not liable for any of your injuries or any of your damages. You could have a case where the insurance company has completely admitted liability. You can have a case where you have soft tissue injuries that last for three, six, nine weeks and then all of a sudden you feel better after some physical therapy. Or you could have a case where you are catastrophically injured and you suffer uh, serious injuries that will significantly affect the quality of your life for the rest of your life. And those two types of cases are very different. I like to say that if you view them, view them on a spectrum. You have um, minimal injuries over here and you have severe injuries over here. And if you have um, a case, you're likely somewhere in the middle. And the question is, where does your case fall on that spectrum? And if you can imagine a situation where you have, for example, a pebble in your shoe, and it is a minor inconvenience, and you keep walking or keep going to wherever you're going, and then you stop, and you take the pebble out of your shoe, and now all's well. How much is that worth? $10,000? $15,000? On the other end of the spectrum, let's say that you're paralyzed from the neck down. What's that worth? A million dollars? Five million dollars? Those are all questions that a jury has to answer. So when we're asked the question, what is the value of my case? We think of the case somewhere within that spectrum. Where does this case fall on that spectrum? And then where does a jury see this case? on that spectrum. And the only way that you can answer that question is to have some degree of familiarity with what juries in our area are doing. And if you don't practice law in Central Virginia, then you'll have no idea how juries in our area are awarding judgments based on certain types of injuries. So we look at your case as a whole. How has this case affected your life? Is it a pebble in your shoe? Or are you paralyzed from the neck down? Or where are you in the middle? of that. It's sometimes very difficult to put a dollar number on the degree of your injury. But we do it by looking at what were your injuries, what effect have those injuries had on your life and on the quality of your life, what type of medical treatment have you had, what type of medical treatment will you need in the future, how long will it last, and overall how has this affected your life. And once we try to quantify all of that, we try to put a fair dollar number on your case based on our experiences with juries in the Central Virginia area.